The Las Vegas Raiders made quite a few moves this offseason to give defensive coordinator Patrick Graham the ammunition he needs to turn the defense around. And in the process, they've gathered for him a collection of guys that either he himself has coached or someone on his staff has coached before to ensure they fit his multifaceted complex system. Chandler Jones being one of the best pass rushers in the NFL certainly doesn't hurt, though. Then there are the guys that Graham inherited. Where do they fit? Of course, Max Crosby fits. He's one of the best edge rushers in the NFL, too. At 6'5", 255 pounds, he actually fits as a 3-4 outside linebacker more than he does a 4-3 defensive end, as long as he's rushing and not in coverage too often. And it looks like Denzel Perriman will be staying in his role as the Mike linebacker to follow his first Pro Bowl. But there are some roles in that defense that are coming into question. Slot corner Nate Hobbs is going to compete for his role in the slot with new free agent signee Anthony Everett and a role outside. And linebacker Jayon Brown, an excellent cover linebacker, is going to compete for a linebacker spot. So what's going to happen with Divine Diablo, who came on late last year and made the defense better? Perriman had the best linebacker coverage grade in the NFL in 2020. And even though he was right there in 2021, he didn't stop the catches. So will the Raiders give Perriman a chance to iron things out and keep the green dot on his helmet? Or will they take him out for Brown, who can really cover? Will Brown have a full-time role or will he just be out there on passing downs? And what happens with Diablo? He is good against the run, but how much of his coverage will improve for year two? Him being out there on passing downs could depend on that. He's a versatile player too, so what about him playing strong safety on passing downs? Or what about putting him at strong safety period for Jonathan Abram? His career with the Raiders hasn't worked out at all so far. We'll see how patient the new regime is with them this season. But back to Diablo, a good athlete that started out as a receiver at Virginia Tech but eventually became a strong safety where he patterned his game after former Virginia Tech strong safety Cam Chancellor. And he did such a good job of that, they changed his number from 25 to 17, Chancellor's own number there. At 6'3", 225 pounds or 33 inch long arms, Diablo has the size and length to play in the box and cover tight ends. And with his 4440 speed and agility, he can cover just about anyone in college. And Virginia put his versatility to use as he covered the slot at times and actually played some single high. Diablo could actually be the perfect complement to free safety Trayvon Merrick, who can cover man-to-man -man and play in the box. So when Merrick has a man coverage assignment, Diablo can hold down the back end just fine. But of course, I want to see Merrick on the back end using his great range way more often than not, and Diablo covering opposing tight ends. With his height, weight, length, and speed, I would love to see him develop into an answer for Travis Kelsey. The Raiders brought Brown in to play linebacker and he's good in coverage so Will seems like the position for him. And since Abram isn't doing anything at strong safety, it would be nice to see Diablo in a role there. He proved he can play the run in the box at linebacker last year. And now, I want to see him unlock his tight end coverage potential. It would get the Raiders best 11 on the field on defense too. Thank you very much for watching, see you next time.